Welcome back, Murderheads. This is What the F Trikes on Facebook Marketplace. At first, you got a 1955 trike for $2,000. They say it's homemade. You don't say. <laughs> what in the heck are we looking at here? What, what in the crazy helmet wearing window liquors are we got going on here with this stupid ass invention? <laughs> it might have three wheels and be constituted as a trike. But this is absolutely horrible. I don't know what you were trying to accomplish here, but whatever you were trying to accomplish, please never try to do it again. Uh, next guy, 2018 Custom for $3,000. Holy meth up Customs. This is exactly why you don't get drunk in the garage and do drugs, because if you have a Geo Metro and some motorcycle parts sitting around, you build this shit. What in the absolute app were you thinking, dude? You literally cut the whole front end up a Geo, for God's sakes. Well, up next, we got the Bill of Sale trike for $650. Well, once again, little Timmy's been hard at work in the design department, designing his first trike, and then Arts and Crash with Crackhead Bob took over and decided to follow those plans to AT and build this ugly POS. Boy, I sure hope they like changing belts considering they use the Corvair engine. Uh, next got a 1989 Cobra Trike for 11-2. This here is just dumb, in my opinion. I don't understand this. You know, the point of riding a trike or a motorcycle is to feel the wind in your hair, feel the freedom, not put yourself in a damn sweat box. If you absolutely feel the need to sweat out your damn soul, you know, Home Depot and Lowe's sell the at-home sauna kits. Nobody else wants to be out around you after you've been riding around in this thing all day coming out smelling like swamp ass. Uh, next got 2015 Custom Trike for $31.50. What in the fiero hell do we got going on here with this piece? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> yeah. I ain't got a Fiero sitting out there. I think I'm just gonna go out there and I'm gonna cut it right down in the middle. And I got parts of the motorcycle and I'm gonna weld it all together and I'm just gonna ride this thing around Florida because you know in Florida the salt water is screwing with your guys' brains down there. Uh, next got a custom trike for $4,000. Seller <laughs> says, this shit's a cool bike. I think you got part of that wrong. The cool word didn't need to be there. It's the shits. You had it right there for a moment, and then you got a fart in your brain and went sideways. This is just stupid. This is another person that wants to sweat out their soul and all their demons and make the rest of us smell their swampy ass after they get out from riding around all day. These are the people that come and sit beside you when you're trying to eat your cheeseburger. Just, you smell that permeating ass funk burning everybody's nose. Up next, got a 1969 Volkswagen Beetle trike for $25,000. Dude, $25,000? What, what, what exactly are you getting for $25,000? Besides a cut and half Volkswagen? Get the hell out of here with that shit. Up next, got a 2000 V8 trike for $47,50. Well, on this episode of Crackhead Builders, we've got... I don't know what the hell this is. Why is there platforms up that high on there? Is it supposed to be mud guards? I don't know what you got going on here. But please never torture the rest of us with this again. Uh, next, got a 1980 trike for $35,000. It's Midnight Crackerella, don't you worry none, cause Peter the Creeper, the peyote eater, has come at you for a night of fun. What in the absolute ever we looking at here? I mean absolutely, why in the hell does this even exist? Somebody has watched way too many Disney shows growing up. <laughs> I'll get my princess one way or the other, I'll build my own carriage. <laughs> Because all the girls want to come ride in my carriage. <laughs> this is just <this> dumb. <laughs> I don't get why somebody would spend that much time to build this. <laughs> what kind of mind-altering things do you have to be on to cook up this concoction? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> the carpet, the rug, <laughs> is Aladdin riding in there too? 
Uh, next got 2004 Boss Hoss Trike for 32.9. Oh, this is definitely a what the F trike, but not a what the F trike in a bad way. This thing's actually pretty damn cool from the extreme paint job it's got on there. Now, folks, this is what True Fire is supposed to look like. This person here, they took notes from Mike Lavalley. This is the way it's supposed to look when you're done if you're going to do an actual True Fire paint job. This thing's actually pretty damn cool with that big V8. Well, that's all I got for you today. If you liked today's video, smash that like button, consider subscribing, and I'll see you in the next one.